race two of the season takes place here at the Phoenix International Raceway. A 76,000 capacity racetrack that has been a staple of the IRL calendar since 1996. Phoenix is a popular track among the drivers, but it's not a circuit for the unwary. Beware of the unique dog leg in turn two, which tends to produce some push or understeer and send the unprepared sliding into the wall. No other track in the season is quite like it, so rookies should take care. Phoenix is a short track and will be running with the high downforce short oval wing configuration. High speeds are not an issue here and the length of the circuit means that you're going to be running in traffic for much of the race. Make sure your car is set up to deal with this and stay alert. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of IndyCar Series Race Number 2. Um, this is at Phoenix and if you watched the first episode, we did terrible. But I did um, turn down the, I completely turned off the music. I didn't even realize there was music playing because when I record I can't hear the game audio. So I didn't realize there was music playing. When I edited it, there was nothing I could do because live commentary. Oh, good God. Um, so I turned down the music completely. So hopefully that solved. You guys can hear me good now. Car is handling so damn weird. This track is so bumpy, I'm getting air off the turns. Ran three and four way different right there and gained two tenths. That looks promising. So far we're P8. And we qualify P8 for Phoenix. That's that's great. This was back before Twitter, so instead of just putting their, you know, app, they're putting their freaking website. Huh. Ah, oh, the PS2 days. I wonder if these are real websites. They must be. Some of them don't even have, like, their own. Wait. There's 26 cars in this race. There's only 24 last one. <laughs> Alright, let's not spin it in ring three. Like, when we get going, like we did last episode. Because that sucked. I'm going to chill behind this guy. I don't get black flagged. I don't know what those arrows are above that car for, but I ain't going to pass them. Alright, now. Ooh, I about got ran over. Oh, he gave me no ba no room to come back down. Oh, that could have been sketchy. Get off. Look, I'm just trying to finish this race. I don't want to get disqualified or something again. Oh my God, the car's so tight. It's handling like crap. Change views. Yeah, let's go with this one. For now. Did 
got a nice launch off that turn. Try and follow the line they are on. So tight in one and two. Ooh. Ooh. Eddie Cheever Jr. right there trying to kill us. This car is insanely tight getting into one. Like, this is really bad. Ooh, I figured it out. God, this car is tight. I wonder if we have damage from that in earlier contact. Oh my God, those bombs just sent me straight into that wall. God. Oh, I think we just wrecked our teammate. Yeah, that was Dan Weldon. He wasn't in the last race. Definitely wasn't trying to wreck him. Maybe these two are beating and banging up in front of me. They're starting to scare me a little bit. I don't know what they're doing. I broke way too late right there. Well, let off, not the brake. It's like the AI is going full throttle around this damn track. I don't get it. I don't know what the arrows do, but I turned that bar thing on the far right down a lot I don't know what it did maybe it adjusted my wings to loosen it up that's how F1 2010 used to be I think that's actually what it did because I can turn good now I believe we are the last car on the lap. Or something, because everyone else is nowhere 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 near us behind from behind. God I can't talk. The guys behind are nowhere to be seen. There we go. You can run three and four basically wide open, I just realized. I know you can't run one and two wide open. Oh god, I didn't turn in on time. Okay, maybe you have to lift a little bit. Because I had a lift right there. I would have nailed the wall. Gained on the leader a little bit. I keep saying a little bit. I hope they wreck up there. It's a crazy pack. And we're just chilling back here. With a great run through three and four. 
Seems like every time we get three and four good, we screw up one and two. Oh, they're wrecking. What a save. Oh, good God. That guy up there smoking. We got hit. Come on, P18. We need them points. Got dead last last race because I disqualified. Because while editing it, I realized what we had to do. We had to do a stop and we had to have a drive through or stop and go or something. And I just kept going. I can't tell. What you guys don't realize on, on the capture card, if I look over my computer, it's not really all that pixelated. Like, obviously, it is a little because it's PS2. But for me, I can't really make out the cars in front. I can't really make out the colors too well because it's extremely pixelated. So I can't tell if he's kind of like ghosting or something or if that's smoke. Oh, that's definitely smoke. It's a great run through one and two. I think I just figured that turned out finally. It's the second time he's done that. Hopefully he just wrecked himself, idiot. Someone's going slow up there. I think it's an idiot that kept nailing us. I don't know, unless something happens, I don't think we're going to get anything really better than 18th. It's not quite used to the controls and stuff in this game. Or the handling, not really the controls. But we are not quite halfway yet, so we could really improve or get disqualified. <laughs> That's the halfway point. Oh, God, I about nailed that wall. Castro Neves leading again. Oh, Ilio. Elio. Ilio. <clears throat> I've heard from Tots in different ways. Um, has been dominating this season. He won last race. I really don't want her racing the pack. I don't want to flip. Three wide. Actually, use some brake right there. And a great run, 16th. Maybe the AI don't have good long guard cars. Who knows? With 20 to go. I don't know what he was thinking. Yeah, I drive like freaking animals.
I would love a top 15. Oh, I got that wall again. 15th. Coming up on 15 to go. I'm careful that guy behind me. He's probably going to dive bomb turn one like they like to. Hmm. He didn't. trying everything right now there's a guy swerving up there ooh they almost wrecked go low right there because I know how they are. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to get by these guys. Definitely fast enough, but I don't want to wreck. And the way they're driving right now, it looks like it's a good possibility that I'll wreck. Great run off the bottom off that turn. We have a great car, less than 10 to go. Could we get a top 10? Contact. <clears throat> Six laps to go. All we got right here, trying to get a top 10. Five left to go. Our home phone's going off, and that thing hasn't rang in like a good month. So that's kind of weird. I hope you guys can hear it. Ooh, almost got the wall. Four to go. Yeah, I think 12 is all we got. I mean, they are battling up there. I screwed up the entry to one. Oh, that guy was a nice run, though, on exit. 10th and 11th are going at it. Coming to two laps to go. Do we have anything for 10th? Come on. Babe, 
they're they got to battling is that all we need we're in 11th oh we got down on the apron come on white flag is out side by side for 10th come on oh there's contact that just cost us damn it come on We drove it in deep, gave it everything we had right there. Oh, we put him in the wall, but it's all good. P11. That was difficult. Man, that was difficult. P11. Weldon was two laps down silver trading card yay why are you disappointed Sam you just drove oh, yeah, we qualified eighth Dan's last in points I don't even know what place we're in what place are we in I think we're 19th in points. You'd think it would tell you, but I guess not. I don't know where the next race is. Let's find out. Yeah, Fontana. Damn. All right. That'll be a very fun race. But we'll be doing that next time. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.